Adam explodes on whack over Young Thug getting released from prison. What the fuck do these niggas have to argue about about another man getting released from prison? Let's see. You know, they got they different things too, so maybe- Remo we're... said breaking news, Young Thug is being released today. W Thug. He took the 15. So you're saying he pled guilty and he's now being he released today. He wasn't taking 45. He pled guilty to a non-binding thing. A non-binding thing. Debate, so yeah, it's probably good in his favor. I'm not sure that this is even like, ha has even the made its way. It is... This is from 10, 10 minutes ago. He pled guilty. But this, I don't think, says anything about him being released today. I should probably hit Twitter if I want to see late breaking news. But or I can call the exposers. Yeah, that's a fairly inefficient way of what? getting to the bottom of it. <laughs> um, Here wait, it goes. We fool. might we might be you logged told on me that the exposers already sent the report. Bozo, this my man <laughs> Prince. Okay, <laughs> sentence is as follows. Uh, <laughs> 40 years to serve first five years in prison, commuted to time served, followed by 15 years probation, backloaded to 20 years if successful, then commutes to time served. After reporting for the first half of probation, special conditions, after 48 hours of release, stay away from Metro Atlanta for the first 10 years. 10 years Ex of no Atlanta? Exceptions, any wedding, graduations for college, immediate family, get up to 24-hour leave after 48. Each year has to make an anti-gang and anti-gun four times a year. Each year of his probation can include a benefit concert, and each year he has to perform 100 hours of community service. Can't have... I spank that boy. <laughs> they spank that nigga. <laughs> Yo, no homo, bro. They spank that nigga, though, twin. Normally his ass contact. cooked. With any members that of the street can't so far as run a red light or his ass going to prison forever. Exceptions is, is of his. Oh my brother, God, um, GG, look, bro. And kitchens as long as um contract. How the fuck did even get out? Except as necessary to conduct business on his musical career. If they can't do it, they'll serve this portion. No criminal street game activity. No hand signs. No promotions. No contact with victims or families. Can't have any firearms. Can be um, within reach of a firearm if a licensed deputy or security detail on his team. You talking that shit and the exposure sent me this at 327. It's almost like we should talk about the news and not who told you about it. <laughs> no. Who it, gives a f no, listen. Nobody cares <laughs> about your stupid little internet the exposers. gang. Exposers. Nobody cares. The exposers. We care about Young Thug coming home, not your stupid the clubhouse crew. That is about Young Thug coming home. We don't care. We would rather get the information from Twitter where we see the exact no. same thing. <laughs> Remo didn't send you nothing. <laughs> Remo the primo. Remo told me. He gave me all that information. No, I just did. chose That's not cat. to read it all why out. That is crazy. Why are you hating on the movement, though? I'm just telling you, nobody gives a f that your little clubhouse crew. Hey, no real shit, though. We don't give a fuck. Hey, that's real shit, though. Nigga going on and on. We don't give a damn. That's real shit. I told you. What do you mean? It's Let's talk about the actual fucking news, not who told you. That, what do you mean? You're so excited to brag about your little internet game. No, I, Nigga got to teach him how to run a podcast, ain't it? Say it. Let me hit the exposures. I went to it. They already said it. Okay, and that's good, but now we can talk about the actual news. I mean, you mad because it didn't come from your little pipsqueak little crew. Let's talk the about it. do I care? You always mad, bro. No, I'm just telling you, you that. You hate on the movie. I'm telling you, on behalf of everybody watching this, nobody cares about your clubhouse gang. Who does it? I know that probably hurts your I feelings. I can't tell. But it's true. They tune in every day. Who? Every day. 40 people. 20. You got your <laughs> dumb ass mind. 24 hours a day, seven days a week, the last three years. Welcome home, young thug. Unfortunately, I have bad news for you. There are busters like this that you're going to have to now share air with. But actually, on a good side of things, didn't it say something about he's not allowed to fraternize with gang members? I'm so maybe, maybe he'll be able to avoid you. I'm a businessman. No, sort of. Ain't no sort of. I'm a businessman. Could you give me 20 or 30 minutes worth of updates about your diaper company? Oh, uh, <laughs> Okay, welcome home, Thug. Definitely. Probably not the best place to have this conversation, but now he's back. But he can't stay in Atlanta. Where do you think he's going to go? Straight up, hold that nigga. Florida. Wow. 
die. What the f*** is he going to do in Miami? Work. Enjoy life. I think he was like mostly out here besides Atlanta before. No, so no, I'm going to think that he's probably going to come back here. I'm going to tell you why out here shouldn't be a great choice. Why? Gang? He can't be around gang members. Yeah. Hmm. Well, the Dummy. good news is that like 99% of the population out here are not gang members. What the no. fuck? Gotta be cap. A large percentage <laughs> yeah. of studios that's involved in his uh, involved in his world in music, yeah, for sure. Our gang members. He's gonna right? have to be so unbelievably careful. Do you consider that fifteen years of probation to basically be like a trap? Because it's gonna be it's gonna be so down. hard, right? To like you have to shut it down. Every I mean, crazy. single thing about his life is gonna have to be so scrutinized in order to not. You see what violate. just happened? They snatched dirt, let thug out. Mm. And I think Hey, Thug best bet. Easier said than done, but he got to take the Jay-Z method, man. You know what I'm saying? Jay-Z got to take a script from his page. Because he somehow was a gangster rapper, but he ain't fall down the trap of doing that shit forever. He's a businessman now. He got the alcohol shit. He created a brand outside of that shit. You know what I'm saying? To promote. And he lit. He ain't get stuck in the game. He, he found a way out using his name. You know what I'm saying? That's what Thug need to do. All this rapping shit is cool, but at the end of the day, see it what they'll do. They put you around gang members. They'll lock you up for no reason. It's a lot of shit that they will do to you when you rap. So sometimes it's best to get the fuck out the game. You know what I'm saying? That's just that's just what it is. I'm going to tell you. Most people I would bet against them surviving this. Mm. Thug, he, he just tall. did close to three. He's no dummy. Um, I, I believe he's going to survive. It. You know what I'm saying? So I believe he's going to go to Florida. It's not smart to go to New York. Um, the gang he represent home base is New York. He should young boy himself. He should just move to like a, a, a nice house off in Utah where he won't have to be around anybody unless Did he a young boy still go to jail? He chooses to be around them. No, that would, would be a very safe method. I believe Florida would work for him. He mm -hmm. can go up there, you know, Trippy Red got a nice big crazy house right outside of Miami. You ain't got to be in Miami on the beach or nothing like that. You go get him a nice spread out there for a little bit of nothing. You know what I'm saying? Don't you feel like moving to Florida is kind of like a rapper acknowledging that their career, that their career's best days are kind of behind them? No. What? You stay out here if you really got shit going on, right? Like, you can bro, afford to go hell to no. Florida if shit has kind of cooled off a little wait bit. Wait up, bro. Hell no, bro. Wait up, wait up. Los <laughs> Angeles, Atlanta, New York, uh -huh. Florida. He cannot Facts. go to New and Houston. York. He forgot about Houston. No, these Too are the cops. four places the industry thrives in. Right. I just feel like Miami. It's kind of like you go to the club, you chill out. But like, you know. who said go to the club? You don't move to Miami to blow up. Everybody goes to Miami to work. But you don't you got move the there, there in order to He explode. doesn't need to blow up. He's already blown up. You move there once you feel like your career is kind of in cruise control. Cool and Dre studio is down there. Cal is down there. Liv is down there. Yeah, you I think Adam is fucking tripping. I mean, L.A. is cool. Don't I feel like L.A. lost some aura, bro. I'm not going to lie. Like, L.A. lost aura. Everyone knows it's Houston, Florida, Atlanta. You know what I'm saying? I stay in Atlanta. It's lit here. Trust me. You can come here and get some shit. You can get some shit moving here. Because a lot of, it's like the underground scene. A lot of people are here. A lot of rappers come through here. Niggas like to come through here, flex how they got money and shit. A lot of dumbass nigga shit. You know what I'm saying? So Atlanta's cool. Florida's cool as fuck. Houston's cool as fuck. But LA is like, I don't know, bro. I kind of look at that shit as weird, bro. LA just give me Diddy vibes. You got you one club and two producers. Huh? You just named two producers Everybody, and one club. Everybody, listen. Florida's the place to go before Los Angeles and New York. The women, the buy facts. Huh? Yes. Nah, I agree. If a hundred K hit my account right now, nigga, I'm going to Florida. I'm not going to LA. I'm gonna be on that first flight to Florida in every fucking club, bro. I'm not going to LA. I'll go after because niggas say it's a good place to work, meet up, network, you know what I'm saying? But if I'm trying to chill, just have fun, vacation, I'm going to Florida. This nigga Adam is not tuned, tapped in, bro. These days. Yes. L.A. and New York way more relevant. You can Hell really no. Austin. Right Fuck. now, today, what's going on in L.A. and New York? What's going on in Miami? Everything. What? That's where everybody migrates to, to spend their time. Bro, you know how many people you could catch just walking through the lobby and go to the hit factory and call Cool and Dre and hit their studio and get to work, get the work done? 
is a million places to shoot your videos. I got it. He should move to Chicago. Oh, uh, man, you just trying to troll a black man down. Be no, trolling. I think that he could do very well out there. No. He trolling. He don't need to move nowhere where it's a fire at already, bro. Might be a little bit cold for his preferences, but no. I think he'd do well I, out there. I believe he's going to go to Florida, and he's going to play. The, get him a nice big spread on the outskirts and be all right. You know who looks good in all this? Mariah the, sen- the Scientist, because she held him down throughout She stayed all this. down. What about Gunner? You think he's going to reconvene with Gunner, or you think it's over? No, he got business with the man. Yeah. He signed to him. In theory. Not in theory. That's a fact. He could very easily be a non-active participant in all that. Let him do his thing. You're still signed to me technically, but I'm not going to actually be in the same room as you ever. Well, you know, I don't know. Me knowing Thug, Thug understands business. I can see a, um, I can see a gunner in, in Thug Cons, uh, uh tour. Mm, I like that. Yeah, I hope we got in on the rap. Chris Music hit too fucking hard. You know what I'm saying? Y'all let me know what y'all thought about that.